You're welcome once again to Deep Thought Films. Yes, this is the very last episode of Stepping Into Maggie's Shoes. Wow, we've come a long way, right? And yes, I have been receiving your feedbacks, your amazing testimonies, your prayers. Thank you so much. Yes, myself and the Deep Thought team were saying a big thank you. Thank you for all those amazing feedbacks. And yes, we don't want to leave you comfortless. I'm sure you're wondering what next, what movie are you going to give us? Yes, we have a new series that is coming up titled Decent Assistant. But after that, we need to produce another project for you so that we do not leave you comfortless. So yes, you are our viewers and we want to find out which of the novels you would prefer us to shoot. Yes, like you know, we have 30 titles and so far we have adapted Stepping Into Maggie's Shoes, In Her and I, Now Decent Assistant, Three Is A Crowd. So we have about 26 novels that we are yet to adapt. So this year we're hoping to adapt one or two or three of these novels as the Lord gives us grace. Yes, we have My Father's Farmland, we have Flirtatious, we have Mwala, yes, and we have that night in room 401 and i'm sure you're asking me what does it entail so the thing about our production is that we should based on the resources available to us per time we have the very low budget productions like our skits and children and teenage short films and we have the average budget like movies like finding the one um three is a crowd and we have the very high budget productions like stepping into Maggie's shoes and in her and i in her and i season three and four you were you were a part of it thank you for those who supported massively so yes we want to make any of this but it largely depends on the resources available to us so yes we are asking for your hand of help we are asking for your hand of support. We need you to support us in making any of this into another reality that will bless lives. Thank God for stepping into Maggie's shoes. It was a wonderful woman of God who executively produced that project. Yes, she financed it. May the Lord bless her richly in Jesus' name. So yes, you too, you can be a supporter. You can be a supporter of this. So why don't we go on a journey and let's see um, um, the locations, the kind of scenarios that these novels actually present to us. So let's start with My Father's Family. Would you like us to produce My Father's Family? Come with me. Do you prefer us to shoot My Father's Family? What's your answer? Or would you prefer if we made this into a movie that night a room forward that speaks about music ministers and their keyboards come with me <laughs> or would you prefer us to shoot this yes would you like us to adapt flirtatious into a movie flirtatious is about two kids from the orphanage you know the orphanage they're usually brother sister eventually without the knowledge of the orphanage they got married and a whole lot of drama happened um, a lot of flirtatious events in fact the story plenty like seriously i don't even know how many seasons this will be but it will watch your while so what's your choice come with me or would you prefer us to shoot Nwala? a love story of a young girl of how she had to make a very difficult choice between a familiar lover and a new lover she didn't like. And we journeyed through a marital life and even to a childbearing state. You know, the story is so full and beautiful. So which is your choice? Please let me know. I need to catch the right. To be I thought you were what's best for me I looked into the mirror All I saw was you I wanted to be you That you were what's best for me 
Ecclesiastes chapter 7, and verse 26 says that there is something more bitter than death. That is the love of a strange woman. The love that she offers you will be to you like you're caught in a net. And a hug around you will seem as though you've been bound with chains. But the scripture says that a man that fears God will, will escape. But the sinner will be caught in her trap. And the sinner has been caught. I, I have displeased God. And, and that disobedience has made me a prey for the spirit of immorality. I have been sleeping with eight married women in this church. Jesus! And, and and I think this is because of the loophole that's already been opened. I've, I've been disobedient to God. I've displeased God. How did I displease God? Because I don't even know. My earliest recollection, my best recollection of the reason why I started this ministry was because a woman told me she was going to sponsor my ministry. And because of that promise, I hastily left Baba Fire's church to start my own. But I found out that her love was like a net, and her hug around me has had me chained in the trap of adultery. I called you here today because I am closing down the church. What? My counsel to the branch pastors is that they, those of them who feel that God has called to them should keep the churches and ask God what names he would have them call their respective ministries. And the remaining branches I will bring under the ministry of Baba Fire. And I myself will be there to learn and to grow again spiritually. I want to ask you to please forgive me. Forgive me for, for misleading you, for bringing you under a ministry I'm not even sure God is in. But when you're on the wrong road, no matter how long you're on it, it would never lead to a good destination. The best thing to do is to take a U-turn and start again. I hope that somehow you will forgive me and then I will find your friendship again. But I reckon that it is better to lose eight years of ministry and to lose eternity with God. Mm. 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 Yes, he's coming. Hi, Happy. Hello, Mrs. Bacot. Hello. Hi. 
you know, we actually thought we will bring in an emotionally unstable person as a wife that we could push around. But God, he the savior, a warrior, a lifesaver, in a bipolar patient. <sighs> Thank you for everything. Thank you for not destroying my son. Thank you so much. He told me everything. Thank you. I really appreciate everything. It's fine. He told me everything. It's fine. God bless you. Amen. You know, Happy, I wish I had said something the first time I saw you seated in front of me in church. Maybe I would have had the privilege of having you as my wife. You're a good man I missed. And you are a gold mine I wasn't patient enough to have. I was desperate to get married. I know for a fact that you, you, you would have been the best man for me. Maybe, just maybe, if I had been patient enough, I would have had you. But life happens, right? And we make a lot of mistakes. But we get to. live up to the consequences of our actions. But look on the good side. That's a life lesson, right? We need to speak up when we have to. Speak when you have to. Yeah. Can I get all that home? the last hug some months back and I think that would do I'll miss you I'll miss you hey so I'm here again I'm here again so have you made up your mind have you decided the one that you want us to shoot next my service farmland Nguala that 1941 of flirtatious. All right, so in case you have thought of the one you want us to do, make sure you write this in the comment section. And also, don't forget to support us. So we actually need that support. There's no denying it, because we need to produce this content. And yes, a lot of people have been saying, okay, what is the cast going to be like? Is it going to be like scenes? Is it going to be like three is a crowd? Are it going to be upcoming stars? So the truth is the resources available to us determines the type of cost, crew, equipment, locations that we're going to be using. You can't imagine if we have a 30 million budget 
to when we have a 3 million naira budget. So the production will definitely be different. But the thing about deep thoughts is that we do not just sit down and say, oh, until we have 100 million, we're going to shoot. So even if it's 3 million we have, we'll, we'll go ahead and shoot. And if God provides 30 million, we'll go ahead and shoot. So you can be a big supporter of us. You're 1,000, you're 5,000 naira, you're 1 million naira, you're 3 million naira, you're 30 million naira. You can be of support to us in producing a powerful evangelical slash entertainment movement. So, what's your answer? The account details is on the screen right now. We have our Wemma Bank account, we have our domiciliary account, and we have our PayPal. Everything is displayed on the screen right now. Mm -hmm. Talk to you. So go back to your movie. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. It's okay. Big branches that small. Hmm? It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> What's that? What's that? What's wrong? Are you okay? Please water. Water, please. Don't move it. Please water. Sorry. Ati bato ti de la ti ko. Ah. E wo mi tu. Oshie. Eh. Kini koni mo fe ko ni koko. Lo lo ru fi aje. Be ni. O lo ru fi aje mi na. Ni but oh Lord, is there no shame in that room? Hmm. Ah. Hmm. Ha. So we must do well with our Lord. We pay. We take the Lord. We must turn our direction to our Lord. We must let it all be. Be but your Lord will die. Call upon the name. Hmm. Hmm. Raima. Yes. Inu Olorun o dun si mi nitori pe mo gegun fun e ko leto ko si da ki iranse Olorun gegun fun eniyan hmm 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 raima ma se pe fun eniyan o sise ma gegun fun o ma bere o nko un to wu ki eyan le se si e ma gegun fun o hmm hmm inu Olorun o dun si Ogbo o kare emi fi temi keko ni o laye mi mi o tu gbe yan gegun mo iyawo re siko nwa
HIV positive. <laughs> God, you try. Well done. I guess that's the way it goes now. You carry my cross. To think that I did a lot of unthinkable things to get married to you. And I've never enjoyed you for a day. You've not even touched me. Just except once after a wedding. Mm. And to think that I was beginning to fantasize that after we settled down here in the village, that someday, very soon, I will be wrapped in your warm embrace. Now God decided to pull this joker on me, right? Guess I have to be a married nun all the days of my life. Hey, look on the brighter side. Um, I have a job, you know. I don't have long to live. I'm going to die very soon. And uh, when I die, you are free to marry whoever you want. It could even be Gabriel. I don't even know what to say. God, you are well done. The room feels quite cold. I like it. Oh, come. Come and see. Okay. <sighs> can I help you get warmer if you, if you can come closer? I hear that the human heat is more powerful than any heating system. Mm. Really? We can Google it on my phone if you come closer. Yes. <sighs> Look, I'm sorry for for all I've cost you. I know the sorry is not enough to undo what's been done. But I just pray that you'll find it in your heart to forgive me. I know that HIV is not uh, its not a small matter. It's a serious one. So I understand if you don't want to, oh. if you don't want to come closer. You know, so. No, it's, it's fine. Um, I wished for the shoe. And yes, I got it. And if HIV is part of the package, I, I definitely have to bear that too. I wished for three kids, God gave it to us. So I'm good. Are you serious? You're sure? Yeah. You 
weekend. Now we can go into the holy of holies now and offer deep, deep prayers. Yeah, very deep prayers. As yes, maybe, maybe if we even go now, my head will be able to connect with this message. Okay. I will get more revelations. Are you serious? Yes. Okay. But it's not good to rush into the holies of all this, right? So. Are you sure? I'm sure. It's for better, for worse. I promise this is not going to be worse. It's sure going to be the best. No, I trust God. <laughs> Yes, we did it. You did what? Hey, hey, mommy. <laughs> Don't swear it now. I mean, after so long, you should be happy for me. No, I did carry out my research. And from my findings, it's possible for a couple to still have fun, to still enjoy their life, even if one of them has HIV. Yes, um, I've been using PREP. It's a form of prevention for the past three weeks. Yes, I've been using it. What's that? Oh, PREP. That's pre-exposure prophylaxis. But mommy, it is expensive, like $2,000 a month. And I have to use it every day of my life. But it's just one of those things. Okay. Does it work? <sighs> Well, from my research, I heard it works. But do I have an option? I don't. There's no other option. Or do you want me to divorce my husband and come back home? No. But your life is important. And Mom, I know my life is important. I, I wish this was not happening, but it is. So I just have to live with it. And most importantly, what if we flip the coin? To the other side. What if I was the one who had the virus? Would I want my husband to leave me? No. So I'll keep taking the pill every day of my life. God has been good to me. So just like my name, I'll try to be happy, enjoy the life I have with Ray, and bless other people's lives. All right. All right. Hmm. Oh, Wally. Raymond, <laughs> <laughs> Bio no in the year, but to one who are back now. One who call you do really. That's your dog, more daddy. Hm? 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 Raima? Yes, sir. Muti farabale uwe dada. Lati biyo du milu. Tu uti pada di lati iku. Hmm? Mm hmm. Musi tiri daju daju. We. Ududu wakun. Omulu bide lati iku. Raymond, 
Raima Mukio kuo lili Mukio kuo lili Igbimo ijo yi ti se ipade Lori orore Abaja de ipade Igbimo ijo Onu wani mo leta uwa mi yi Iko to uwa onu wakwe kwa uwa Ninu ishe yi na shi yi O to a si kufu o la te pada si o li ipo na. A te gbe o ga. Keke bi igbe a keji. A la koso a gba enjoy. You have been promoted. To the post of assistance. Vianela. O fasia. Of this mission. Congratulations. Raiba, o que o que é isso? O que o que é o o Oh, bo sure si no anye re. Oh, tu lo le ma o. La ma o. Ni no ise ira se to gba yi o. Ah, oru sure fu o. Wow. That was a beautiful story, right? I pray for everyone who is watching right now who has lost something important in destiny as a result of greed covetousness, sin, going ahead of God, wrong company, um, parental error while growing up, that the God of restoration will restore God's original purpose and plan for your life to you in the name of Jesus Christ. All your lost years will be recovered in the name of Jesus. Thank you once again for watching Sims. And yes, like I have been coming intermittently um we want to produce another movie another series that will bless your life like this so please kindly be of support to us the account details is on the screen again and i use this opportunity to thank the executive producer of sims god bless you ma and um, thank you for lending a hand unto the lord um, everything about you is blessed as everyone is watching this movie and they are blessed it's not just Opemi or Kitsune that gets the credit for it it's not just deep fat films that get the credit for it even you will give your five loaves and two fishes to this ministry I pray that the Lord will count it unto you for righteousness and will enlarge your course thank you very much man so we're passing the baton to you as well. Be of support to us. Support us in making another life-changing production in whatever capacity you think you can be of help. But the project can end up being like scenes in terms of budget. And it could end up even being like three is a crowd. So remember, whatever the Lord provides for us, we're wrong with it. God bless you. Stay blessed. Keep watching Deep Talk. Thank you for watching today's episode of our series, Sings, Stepping into Maggie's Shoes. I believe that it has been a blessing. To support us in making more of these life-changing movies, kindly give your support to Deep Thoughts Ministry International 01230403090 Wema Bank. And to also use our PayPal account, kindly use deepthoughtsnovo at gmail.com. Our dollar domiciliary account also goes thus 
0595032281. Guarantee Trust Bank. Swift code GTBINGLA. Opeyemi Morenike Akitunde. For more information, send us a mail at deepthoughtsonline at gmail.com. To enroll in our filmmaking academy, kindly chat plus 234-814-746-8257. Do not forget to like this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and please share. Thank you for watching once again. God bless you. Work could be better than this The life of my dreams